Yeah, what's your name? Gabriel Jr. Yeah. Hey, can we interview can we interview you very quick? What do you believe happens when we die? When we die? Yeah. Um, you know, we, uh, we have this belief, you know what I mean? What I want, really, you know what I want? I want to be able to continue, you know what I mean? Mm. I, I mean, as far as heaven, I accept it. I think um, nobody ever be around it, right? Mm. We're all uh, sinners, so. Yeah. Um, I want to be able to just, you know, just to go. Yeah. I'm, d I'm dead and I, I want to just go, you know? Yeah, yeah. So, so you believe in that there's a there's an afterlife, right? Sure. You mentioned heaven. Yeah, absolutely. Right, right. okay. I agree with you. Okay. What do you think? So, I mean, I believe what scripture says, right? Sure. So we're all sinners, like you said, right? Yeah. We all fall, the Bible says we all fall short of the glory of God. Because yes. God is so holy and his, his standards are so righteous and perfect. That's right. That if we just sin once, and if we even have one bad thought, that's a sin and that disqualifies us from heaven. That's right. But the good thing is, He loved us so much that He sent His only begotten Son, which is Jesus, right. to pay that price for us. Yeah. So, the Bible I, says if we place our faith in Jesus, yes, amen. we can ultimately go to heaven. Yes. Trent. Because because when we place our faith in Jesus, the Father looks at us through Jesus. Yes. So when He looks at you or me, if we place our faith in Him, He looks at Jesus. And you, you're made righteous, and you're made you're made whole That's right. in Christ. Have you ever given your life to Jesus? Yeah. Um, I I've fallen. I've been out in the streets. I continue. I've never lost uh, my faith. I've lost everything else. I believe in in God. You see, you're a believer. You're Absolutely, believer. I am. So you believe Jesus is the only way. Jesus is the only way. Yeah. I yeah. give everything to my Jesus. What brought you on the streets? If you don't mind me asking. Um, uh, alcohol, drugs. Everything. Yeah, yeah. Everything is involved. Yeah. So, uh, I, I never stop believing. My. Yeah. But you, you can fix things. You can, you, you can do it right. Yeah. You can make it up. Yeah, and I believe that's why God sent me here, right? Yes. No matter how old you are, and now no matter how far in sin you are, you're still on this earth, yes. and you can still turn things around. Absolutely, you can. Because the bottom line, there is a place. If we don't repent of our sins, there is a place and it's called hell, right? Right. It's a place where there's weeping and gnashing of teeth for all of eternity. Yes. And God's given us the grace and you the grace to, to, to we, turn it all to turn turn it all around. You absolutely. Know what I, mean? I agree. Yeah. I, I, agree. I, I, I believe I believe he's gonna do it for you. And I believe I believe before you die, you're gonna give your life back to Jesus. You're gonna rededicate your I life. I will. I'm prophesying that over you. I really believe it. You have a mother? I do. Yeah. I is there is there has been like has there been a situation with your mom? Yes. Like she passed away uh, on the, the 20th of the next month from COVID. Okay. And my brother this this month on the 13th, and we lost him on the same year. So you're right. That take that, does that take a big toll on you? Absolutely. Uh, nevertheless, nevertheless, I don't lose my faith. I still believe in him. Yeah. yeah. I I still have my higher power. Yeah. And it's Jesus. So. Yeah. Good, Thank man. you so much. I want to pray for you, though. Thank can you. I yes, you? absolutely. You can. What do you need prayer for? Anything specific? I just, I don't want to lose my faith. I've been broken. Yeah. And he's still here. And, he and I just want to let him know that, that yeah. I'm very grateful. So he can restore. He can restore your heart. Yes. All you have to do is just give it all to Jesus. I was addicted to alcohol. I didn't know what to do. I gave it to him. He took it away your knee and give it all to Jesus and cry out, Lord, I don't know what to do. Save me from this addiction. Save me from this situation. Everything could be turned around. He's yes. a God of miracles. So I'm going to pray right now. Well, hold yes. on real yeah. quick. Do yeah. you happen to deal with knee pain? I do. You do? Is it your right knee? Yes. Oh, okay. you want to pray for his knee? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yes. I have titanium. How did you know that? <laughs> Holy Spirit. Yes. He told me you have knee pain. All right. So, yes. so, so, got a word from the Holy Spirit that you have right knee pain. Yes. So you got a titanium. What is it? I have a rod, a titanium rod. It broke uh, my tibia and my fibula on the job site, wow. and it's I got titanium in my right leg. Yes. But does it hurt? Um, it's constant pain, pinching, constant pain. I want to pray for Jesus Please. to heal your knee right now. Please. So, so Father, I thank you for Gabriel, God. I thank you that you're that you're working in Gabriel. I thank you that you sent me to bring the good news and to remind Gabriel of what's to come in his life. 
and in your goodness, Father. I thank you that you're going to restore him, and I thank you that you're going to slowly open his eyes and his heart. I ask for you to give him a heart of flesh and take that heart of stone out. And I thank you for the healing on his leg that you're gonna that you're gonna bring to him now in Jesus' name. So now I command this knee right now to be fully restored in Jesus' name. I command all pain to be gone in the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. I command full restoration on that knee in Jesus' name. How do you how does it feel? I feel good. Like wiggle it around. Do something you couldn't do. Uh, well, yeah, my feet were numb. Not, they're not numb anymore. Your, your, what was numb? Yeah, my feet were numb, but not, they're not numb anymore. It's not so. numb anymore. No. So wow. that one's not numb anymore. No, it's not numb. I could put pressure on it. So. Is there still pain? No. I, hopefully, I can take it with me. <laughs> tell, tell me the truth. Receive tell me the it truth. by faith. Yeah. God so. heals. And it stays healed in Jesus' name. Yes, the it pain does. will not I come back. I want to be able to take it with me, you know? Yeah. Yes. So it's completely healed. Yes. <laughs> Hallelujah. I yeah, Hallelujah. I feel good. I feel good. Thank you so much, guys. Thank you. You hey, have a wonderful you, night. You as well. Take this care. This is a lot of love, man. I, yes. I really, I so really much. care about you. I felt like the Lord wanted me to come here. And we have a YouTube channel. We go out and evangelize, right? Yes. And I felt like the Lord drew me here. And as soon as I saw you, I'm like, I think, I think that's him. I that's think it. that's him. I love you, man. Okay, love you too. Take care. Yeah. Glad you're here. Right. Bye. Bye. Nice to meet you. Pleasure to meet you. Quite Take care. Thank you. Yeah. Bye. Have Take a care, good guys. one.